Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Beloved, all over the globe, all over the continent, it's your servant, Eric Amangwa, bringing unto you Presbyterian Church of Ghana, hour of prayer and truth. Beloved, John 8, 32, ye shall know the truth, and the truth shall set ye free. Beloved, hearing the sound of my voice on this platform, the only truth, and this truth is Christ Jesus. Another name for Christ Jesus is truth. It's through him that you and I will have a place in eternity. Beloved, hearing the sound of my voice, we are in a month of August, and today is Monday, 16th August, 2021. Beloved, I am sharing with you on the team Overcoming Spirit of Bewitchment. I will share with you the part one today. If we say bewitchment, what does it mean? If we say somebody has bewitched someone, what does it mean? Beloved, it doesn't matter who you are. You could be a teacher of the gospel. You could be a prophet. You could be a bishop. You could be a reverend minister. You could be an apostle, an evangelist, a pastor. And if you are not careful, you could be bewitched. You could be under the influence of spells. Somebody hearing the sound of my voice who has bewitched you, who has bewitched your children, who has bewitched your marriage, who has bewitched your finances, who has bewitched your Christian ministry. Beloved, who has bewitched your career? Somebody hearing the sound of my voice. This month of August, I am dealing with spirit of bewitchment. Beloved, this month of August is a very dangerous month. A month whereby we have to stay in prayer. A month whereby we have to stay and pray against all devices of the enemy. Whatever the devil and his cohorts, have assigned against God's people, against the church of God. Beloved, this month of August, we are canceling all their plots. Whatever plot, whatever snails that they have assigned against believers, we are destroying and canceling all their works. We are destroying all their powers. Somebody hearing the sound of my voice. Beloved, we serve a living God, and the God that we serve is still alive. Beloved, when we say bewitchment, what does it mean? When we say bewitchment, what does it mean? Bewitchment is the act of being compelled by an evil spirit to walk in an error before God. Bewitchment is the act of being compelled by an evil spirit to walk in an error before God, to walk in sin before God. Somebody is pushing you into sin. Somebody is leading you into sin. Somebody is fighting against your destiny. Somebody is fighting against all the good things that are asked to come your way. Somebody is fighting against those good things. If such things happen, then it means that such a person is under the influence or is under the spirit of bewitchment. Somebody hearing the sound of my voice. Bewitchment is a very dangerous thing. There are believers shouldn't sleep. Somebody hearing the sound of my voice. Who has
must be with you. Who is controlling you? Who is trying to deviate your mind from the things of God? Who is trying to mislead you? Who is trying to divert your path? Who is trying to cause you to deviate from the narrow way? Who is leading you onto the broad way? Beloved, I come to announce to you on this platform, whoever has been assigned to be with you, may the blood of Jesus Christ that was poured on Gogota, may the blood of Jesus Christ that was poured on Calvary deal with every spirit of bewitchment against your life. Anybody gathered on this platform, those hearing the sound of my voice, as I continue to pray and pray for you, and as we pray together, every spirit of bewitchment today die by fire. Every spirit of bewitchment seized by the blood of Jesus Christ. Beloved, hearing the sound of my voice, Paul uses this spirit of bewitchment or in the Greek word, when we say bewitched, it means that being under an evil influence, being under an evil influence, if you are being under an evil influence, then it means that you've been what? Bewitched. Or to be charmed by error. This means that all your mind is about sin. All your mind is about doing evil all the time. If you are experiencing this in your way, if you are experiencing this in your journey of life, then I am telling you that you are under the influence of bewitchment. You are under the spirit of bewitchment. Beloved, hearing the sound of my voice, whoever has bewitched you, whoever has bewitched your children, whoever has bewitched your career, whoever has bewitched your finances, whoever has bewitched your marriage, whoever has bewitched whatever good thing that belongs to you, may the blood of Jesus Christ do with them tonight in the name of Jesus. May the blood of Jesus Christ do with them. Somebody hearing the sound of my voice, say, oh Lord Jesus, every spirit of bewitchment from my mother's family, from my mother's family, fighting against my success, fighting against my destiny. Oh, may the blood of Jesus Christ do with them, do with them. May the arrows of God do with them in the name of Jesus Christ. Somebody hearing the sound of my voice. Apostle Paul said in Galatians chapter 3 verse 1, Galatians chapter 3 verse 1, it's my anchor test tonight. Galatians chapter 3 verse 1. Galatians chapter 3 verse 1. Apostle Paul said, Oh, you foolish Galatians. Oh, you foolish Galatians. Oh, you foolish Galatians. Who has bewitched you? Who has bewitched you? Paul was asking them a question. Oh, foolish Galatians. Who has bewitched you? Before your very eyes, Jesus Christ was clearly portrayed as crucified. Paul was trying to shake all some sense into the Christians in Galatia who were adopting false doctrines about salvation by works. Beloved, hearing the sound of my voice, Paul was trying to advise the Christians in Galatia that why are they adopting false doctrine? Beloved, hearing the sound of my voice, why are you adopting false doctrine? Beloved, any evil man of God, any evil prophet of God, any evil pastor, any evil reverend minister trying to divert your mind from the true word of God, may the power of God cause them into repentance. May the blood of Jesus Christ cause them into repentance. May the blood of Jesus Christ cause them into repentance in the name of Jesus.
in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. And Apostle Paul said, it was as though after they had received the true gospel of grace, someone had bewitched them to make them change their minds. Beloved, somebody can bewitch you, and if we are not careful, your mind could be changed. Your mind could be changed from hearing the true word of God. Somebody hearing the sound of my voice. As Apostle Paul declared to the Christians in Galatia, I also declare unto somebody hearing the sound of my voice, whoever has bewitched you, whoever is preaching false doctrine unto you, may the Lord cause them unto repentance. May the Lord God cause them unto repentance. May the Lord God cause them unto repentance. Somebody hear the sound of my voice. May you receive the strength of the Holy Ghost. May you receive the strength of the Holy Spirit. So that any time that you pick the Bible to read, may the Holy Spirit be your teacher. May the Holy Spirit cause you to understand. Any time you pick the Bible to read, who has bewitched you? Who has bewitched you? Who has bewitched you? Somebody hearing the sound of my voice. I am sharing with you overcoming spirit of bewitchment. Overcoming spirit of bewitchment. I am dealing with you the part one. Beloved, whoever has cast spells on you, whoever has cast spells on whatever project that you are doing, may the fire of the Holy Spirit, may the fire of the Holy Ghost deal with them tonight in the name of Jesus. Whoever has taken your picture to occultic grounds, whoever has taken your picture to juju people, whoever has taken your picture to any demonic altar, to any shrine, those enchanting against you, may the power of the Holy Ghost, may Holy Ghost fire set confusion in their grounds. Whatever coven that your soul has been tied, whatever coven that the souls of your children, whatever coven that all your pregnancy has been tied with, may the power of the Holy Spirit ah, strike them in the name of Jesus. Strike them in the name of Jesus. Every bewitchment through rumors from demonic authors concerning your life, against your life, seized by fire, seized by the blood of Jesus Christ, and body spreading rumors about you may the power of god strike them one after the other in the name of jesus may them receive the vengeance of god may them receive the anger of god one after the other in the name of jesus christ Somebody hearing the sound of my voice on this platform. Somebody hearing the sound of my voice on this platform. Somebody hearing the sound of my voice. Somebody hearing the sound of my voice. Somebody hearing the sound of my voice on this platform. Ah, you cannot walk. It started three days today. You have been bewitched. They want to assign stroke unto you. You cannot walk properly. You cannot walk properly. Oh, you cannot walk. You've been feeling pains all over your body. All over the joints of your body. You've been feeling pains. It started three days today. Every sign of stroke assigned against you. Those trying to bewitch you through stroke. May the power of God deal with them. And back to the sender in the name of Jesus. Back to the sender in the name of Jesus. Whatever stroke that they are plotting against you. Back to the sender. If it's from your wife's family. If it's from your mother's family. If it's from your brother. Whoever. From your friends. Whatever. It is from your siblings. Back to the sender. Back to the sender. Back to the sender. If it is from your mother's family. Ah, your father's family. It is from your siblings. It is from wherever you are working. Back to the sender. That spirit of stroke. True bewitchment. Back to the sender. There is somebody hearing the sound of my voice. They used to call you a buyer. Ah. Anytime, anytime, any 
right time money comes into your hands, within the shortest period, oh, it disappear. It disappear. It disappear. I came to announce to you, those fighting your finances, ah, or buyer, through any form of bewitchment, may the power of God strike them dead. May the power of God strike them dead. Or buyer, listen to me. If you are not going to church very well, beloved, try to go to church very well. Accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and personal Savior. And if you are not paying your tithe properly, or buyer, I am speaking unto you. Before your finances will be established, pay your tithe properly. Is that or buyer that I'm talking to? Or buyer hearing the sound of my voice? Or buyer on this platform? Is you that I am talking to? Ah! Your profession is that you are a seller, you are a seller, you are a seller, and there is no other way that money, 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 money could settle in your hands. I came to announce to you that whoever is operating against your finances through bewitchment, die by fire, or buyer, let that person die by fire, or buyer, I bless you today. I release the blessings of God over your life. Financially, may you be established. Financially, may you be established. May you pay your tithe and pay it well. In the name of Jesus, or buyer, I deliver your soul from every spirit of death. I deliver your soul from every pit of death. Or buyer, I deliver your soul from every dungeon of, of bewitchment. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Makabala bo sigadalabaya. Lebro masugudu ligabaya. Lebre masugudu ligaba brokatalabaya. Lebro masugudu ligabaya be. Listen to the song. Listen to the song. The blood of Jesus Christ is the only covenant. The blood of Jesus Christ is the only weapon that can destroy every spirit of bewitchment. The blood of Jesus Christ is our hope. The blood of Jesus Christ is the only blood that heals forever. Doctors may cure. Doctors may cure, but they cannot heal. Doctors may cure, but they cannot heal. The only person who can cure and the only person who can heal us forever is Christ Jesus. Hey! Makabalabo zigabalabaya. Lebro ma zugu di liga ba broka talabaya. Lebre ma zugu di liga ba. Somebody hear me the sound of my voice. Any form of bewitchment through blindness. Any form of bewitchment through blindness. Back to the sender. I use the blood of Jesus Christ to wash your face. Begin to see that blindness is gone forever. There is somebody. You've been experiencing cobwebs all over your faces. It's blindness that they are plotting. It's bad luck. It's bad luck. It's blindness that they are plotting. I wash your face with the blood of Jesus. The spirit of cobwebs seized by fire, seized by the blood of Jesus. Hey, Makabalabo, Zigabalaba. Beloved, we serve a living God. 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 The God that we serve is still alive. O katalabo, ziga bala bala be, masukudu liga babo, le kababa baba ba, le masigidi liga ba, bro katalaba ya. Beloved, pray along with me. Say, dear Lord Jesus, any other form of bewitchment, any bewitchment, any form of bewitchment against my destiny, die by fire. Whoever has bewitched me through any other means, oh Lord God, may your blood deliver me. May your blood set me free from every bewitchment. Whoever has bewitched me academically, whoever has bewitched me financially, whoever has bewitched me, oh God, in all areas of my life, Lord Jesus, through your blood, deliver me. Deliver me. Somebody pray this prayer. Pray this prayer. 
Say, Lord Jesus Christ, I pray for deliverance, self-deliverance from every form of bewitchment, any form of bewitchment through accident that has been assigned against me, being it air accident, being it sea accident, accident by road, Lord, deliver me and back to the sender, and back to the sender, and back to the sender. In the name of Jesus. Makabalabo sigabalaba. Lebro masakadalaba. Beloved, hearing the drum of my voice. A bewitched person is a person who blindly clings to sin. A bewitched person always continues to live in the bondage of sin. Beloved, somebody hearing the sound of my voice who has been bewitched and thereby living in the bondage of sin. Oh, may you be set free. May you be delivered. I declare liberation over your life. I declare liberation. I declare freedom over your life. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. May you be freed. May you be liberated. Receive the freedom of God. Kabbalah Bayaba. Any witchcraft, any witchcraft that has been assigned against your destiny to bewitch you, to bewitch your children, may the power of God expose them and let them die by fire in the name of Jesus. May the blood of Jesus Christ expose them, expose them, and die by fire in the name of Jesus. Beloved, you will hear Satan the sound of my voice. It's your servant, Eric Amankwa, bringing unto you, President Church of Ghana, hour of prayer and prayer and truth. Hour of prayer and truth. Beloved, may this week, 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 may this week move with you smoothly. This week, may you experience the favor of God. This week, may you experience the peace of God. This week, may you experience the grace of God. Somebody hearing the sound of my voice. Somebody hearing the sound of my voice. I see great and greater testimony coming your way. Testimony that you have never experienced before. Ah, there is somebody. There shall be evidence and performance in the course of this week. Oh, yes. I see testimony coming. I see testimony coming. I see testimony coming. I see greater things coming your way. Oh, it is all joy. 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 Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. May you be strengthened. May you be strengthened. As we go through this week, may you be empowered. As we go through this week, may you be empowered by the power of the Holy Ghost. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May he lift up his countenance over your life. May the Lord give you peace. May the Lord give you peace. May the Lord give you peace. In shalom. In shalom. You will hear same time the sound of my voice. Next week by this time, it's your sermon that they come and go. Bye-bye.